Come inside, don't be shy, Jolene can't wait to meet you. For a trailer park Christmas, the trailer park way, with a brand new recipe every day. Sending videos from her trailer, yeah she's Jolene Sugar Baker. Come and spend the holidays, the trailer park way. Trailer Park fans and Merry Trailer Park Christmas and welcome to the Trailer Park Test Kitchen and welcome to Trailer Park Christmas 2015 where I'm bringing you a video every day until December 25th. That's 25 days of food videos and maybe some crafts too from the Trailer Park and you can get a calendar at my website TrailerParkChristmas.com and you can follow along because I see today it's day three, and it says gelatin subscribe. I can't even say it. I'm so excited. Gelatin subscribe. Gelatin surprise. Yes. Gelatin is such an exciting thing that we can't even talk about it here in the trailer park because it is a tradition, and it's a secret sometimes. Some people won't even tell you what they're um, actually... Wow, things are already falling down here with the decorations. Um... Maybe I should have used more tape. Um, I used less tinsel this year because my cat has turned into a ravenous tinsel eater. And that has been a big mess. And I, I will say that it's less tinsel, but it's for safety for the cat, who is also gluten-free this year. I have no idea. The vet said that he is gluten-free. He eats expensive food and tinsel. So that's why it's a little bit less tinsel here in Trailer Park Christmas 2015. Anyway, we're talking about the calendar here and we see it's gelatin surprise and um, gelatin is a tradition and I'm going to share with you a special recipe that makes you look like a star and they're chocolate and black cherry and you can put them in little molds that you have but it's super simple and little cupcake um, wrappers. I'm going to show you my secret up next on Trailer Park Christmas 2015. I'll be right back. Welcome back to Trailer Park Christmas 2015, where I'm going to reveal my secret gelatin recipe that makes a great black cherry chocolate kind of gelatin tart that's going to make you look like a star at your next dinner party. What I've got here is one third cup of water and we need to get this boiling because we're going to put the gelatin in it first. So we're going to use our microwave first. So I'll check back with you in just a moment. Okay, now that we have our water boiling, we're going to add six ounces of, uh, this is black cherry gelatin. And I had to get the two small packages because I couldn't find the large six ounces. But we're going to stir this up until it's well dissolved. So let me get that started and I'll check back with you in just a moment. Next up, in another microwave safe kind of container, we're going to add one third cup of chocolate chips right on in there. And this is 12 ounces of, of evaporated milk. And we're going to pop this in the microwave for about three minutes or until it's uh, melting. And then we're going to stir it around. So set your timer. While you got the chocolate melting down in the oven, take a pan. We're going to put this in the refrigerator in just a bit. But I've got the foil little baking cups. This is going to make you look like a star because they just pop right on out of there. I've got some vegetable cooking spray. And we're just going to spray them on out just like that. So go ahead and spray out all the cups and I'll check back with you in just a moment. Okay, now we have our chocolate and our milk mixture here. We're going to stir this together until it's well mixed. There we go. Just getting all the chocolate mixed together. Now this is hot, so be careful. Don't hurt yourself. And we have the gelatin mixture right here. We're just going to mix them together. Now, we're going to mix this for just a little bit and it's going to get thicker. And that's when you know when it's ready to pour in the cup. So let me mix this all up and check back with you in just a moment. Okay, we have our gelatin mixed with the chocolate and milk mixture and we have our sprayed out foil baking cups. We're just going to start pouring some mixture into each of the cups here and we're going to chill this in the refrigerator 
until they're nice and um, kind of jelly and firm. And these are just going to pop out and make the best, cutest little tarts that you can drizzle with chocolate or maybe some caramel sauce or or put a cherry up on top and make them look really pretty. But this just makes you look like a fancy chef because they just look like something that came out of a restaurant. They're just so cute and perfect because the shells of the foil baking cups just make them the best. And we're almost done here. We're going to pop this in the refrigerator and make that magic happen. So set your timer and I'll check back with you in just a moment. And there you have it, my black cherry chocolate tart. And look how pretty that is. They're right here in the little foil wrappers and you just dump them right on out on a plate and you could put maybe some whipped cream or maybe some caramel sauce, just like the fancy restaurants. Or maybe not. Maybe if you take that little thing on top there off, it, they always surprise you like that and it takes forever to get off. There we go. And then it goes all over the place. There we go. Now we can decorate it like a fancy restaurant. And there we go. Almost. There we go. And look at that. You are now a fancy restaurant around the holidays. And it's gelatin. And that's bringing a tradition back around the holidays. Let me just get a little slice of this and see how it tastes with the caramel sauce. Mmm! That is chocolatey caramel goodness. And you can put chocolate sauce up there too. And it just has a great texture that's just out of this world and a perfect ending for a great holiday dinner or maybe a quick dinner that um, you're having over the holidays. It's just really good. I hope you get a chance to make my black cherry chocolate gelatin tart. It has a great tape flavor with that black cherry. We've got more recipes coming up on Trailer Park Christmas. I see tomorrow we're doing a Rumpus Room recap and I'm talking about all sorts of things about the holidays and what more recipes that are coming up on Trailer Park Christmas. Don't forget to download the calendar at TrailerParkChristmas.com. Follow me on Twitter. I'm Jolene's Trailer there. Add me on Facebook, Google+, and most importantly, hit that subscribe button because you'll miss out on all the 25 days of videos if not. I love you all and I'll see y'all back real soon. Merry Trailer Park Christmas. Bye-bye. Slap on all your blue eyes shadow. Watch out for that big tornado. Get all filled with Thunder. pride in the double wide. Visit my store at trailerparkstore.com.